What is the magic that is Michigan's nonprofit and, nonprofit and philanthropic landscape? And I think the answer is uh, how people are indoctrinated into this work. So you could say that, why Michigan? Why not any other state? Could they have every community serviced by a community foundation? Why do other states have uh, youth advisory councils where young people are really making huge philanthropic decisions for their community? And I think it's because people are uh, brought up by you know, a handful of leaders to say collaboration is important, Young people have voice and great uh, contribu contributions to make to, to communities that we as um, a society have to work together towards common uh, issues and that it doesn't really make a whole lot of sense to have um, over competition in the nonprofit sector when resources are scarce and people are really trying to do uh, good things for, for, for the community. So I think it really has to do with how people are brought into this. So when you look at the philanthropic community especially, and you look over the last 20, 30 years, um, by driving through their grant making and through their expectations and through their conversations, that collaboration, true, genuine collaboration, is a priority. Um, people respond to that, and, the, and, and it has been embedded in community expectations.